Kakujo. <laughs> Hello again, bits and bites. This is Kakujo. As always, underslept and overconfident, but let's play Nuclear Throne. Today we're playing another bit and bite challenge. Bit. B and B challenge. It's submitted by Jack of Clubs. It's called the Stack Modus Challenge. Is a reference to Homestuck. Uh, you must play as robot. And when you see a new weapon, pick it up immediately and eat your previously held weapon, no matter what it is. It's as simple as that. Is this gonna be... I don't know. This is very RNG based. This is very... Of course, the music's always louder than I anticipated. Isn't that always... Oh! While I'm changing the sound, bandit? Really? Oh, hey, I get a bee skin now, though. That's fun. But no music! <sighs> I would normally restart a second time, but come on. I get to be Batbot, or whatever the hell he thinks he is. No, no, eat that. Now you gotta use a screwdriver. How you gonna do this to me, Haim? How, <laughs> How you gonna make me a robot and give me a screwdriver? You, robots are used to... Uh, screwdrivers dismantle us. This is some kind of torture right here. That's like handing a pig a butcher's axe. And, and being like, here, have fun. Go kill scorpions. I mean, you don't give a command like that to a pig, though. They don't do much other than deal in mud. You would give them something to do with mud, though, and they're your your pig guy man thing. But I'm just, I'm just saying this is a bad matchup in, for anyone. But also, yes! It's probably also traumatizing core robot. There we go. Pop gun! A lot of people don't like pop gun. A lot of people love the pop Well, yeah, I actually hear fewer voices in love of the pop gun, or maybe that's just the nature of the internet. You see more people crying out saying nay than those who are pleased, because those who are pleased remain quiet. We must all make more efforts to, to reach out and be like, I like the pop guns. Tell them Kakujo sent you. Y you know? Ugh. Editing room Kakujo. It looked like a spooky face! The Illuminati's real! Big bandit. You gotta stop that. You should find a better name. I can't imagine it would help anyone's anyone's temperament to be like, ah, he's bigger than us, let's just call him big. He prefers a husky or beautiful bandit. You know? He he's he he is very confident in himself. Okay, got a machine gun now. But you know when enough people are surrounding him constantly telling him, big bandit, big bandit, what's gonna happen? Really now, okay, that that racing mind is gonna be very circumstantial. This has got, I mean, in, this is entirely, I mean, thank God I have something that's a machine gun and not something like a screwdriver anymore. Just thank you. What is the god in Nuclear Throne? Is it the Rami RNG? Is it, I guess really that is the only gods we have here. No gods, only random number generators. Or really is that not what God is? Uh, it's all subjective, folks. It's all subjective and I'm just a robot in a Batman suit. Old 1964 Batman suit. Oh, I, I, I wish, I wish they changed his voice. I mean, we got B-Skins, why not B-Voices? You could get Adam West for, for robot B-Skin. Come on. I think it's a novel, I'm out of ammo. Hey guys, move, I need that. At least move the, the rat, uh-oh. Flat cannon, oh, oh that's, okay, I'll take, yeah, I'll take that. Oh, I'll definitely take that. Hold on, I wanna go pick up this ammo. Don't go nowhere, now get in me, yeah. Not, not doing terribly. I mean, come on, flat cannon. That's ultra lucky. I want to say, let's get impact risks because risks. Well, now it really is an impact risk. Risk. God damn, I can't even say the whatever. Because if, if I get this for this, then I might not have the weapon here in a little bit. I guess it'd be smart to go for general survivability. And I mean, impact risks. It, it, it pertains to quite a few guns. <sighs> I'm gonna go with impact risks. Wait. I just clicked fi fine. Yeah, impact wrists, whatever. Let's just get let's just get this moving. We gotta find a gun and we gotta use it to kill Stop! Man, I am doing so bad today about dodging the point the venoms. I'm usually really good about that. If there's one ammo if there's one projectile in this game, you gotta you, you gotta you gotta dodge, it's the venoms, they're so slow. God Open oh, into it with open arms, man. That's not how Batman works, robot. Leave it to a robot to not understand how humans work. Or Batman. Oh my god, I got a shovel. Hey, at least eating the flat cannon gave me 2 HP and impact wrists will do nicely with the shovel. Get down there. That's right, that's right, that's right. Get down that hole. Get down that hallway and tell him Kakujo sent you. Mm, yeah, go over there. I sent you on a mission. Where were you? You're supposed to be over there doing crazy things. Oh, great. Oh boy. Oh boy, death and murder. 
Oh, two of my favorite things. Oh, great. Using a shovel to kill maggots. Oh, and one touched me. How delicious. What a delicacy of frustrations. Oh, yeah. Charge at me. I've got to sh yeah, run at the guy with the shovel. Always the best of ideas. Oh, but how nice to have a shovel, right? Come on. We're going to go to the sewers and be all like, kapow! And, and, until we pick up a, I don't know, a laser pistol. Great. That's kind of useful, I guess. Throne butt, though. I mean, especially since we 100% know we're going to be, you know, do the thing we're going to be doing is 100% going to be doing stuff. <laughs> my, my sentence structure is not so strong today, apparently. Oh, no. Ooh, ooh, flame shotgun. Yeah, all right. Again, good weapon. I like it. I like the I like the fact that it seems like it deals about the same amount of damage as the shotgun plus bonus fire damage, but at the same time, I don't like slow burning fuels. Slow burning damages. I mean, I, I, I could have said slow burning fuels, but I realized that was confusing because it actually made sense in pertaining to this. Okay, nose, can we talk about this for a second? Why why you got to itch? Mm. Oh no! Man. Well, I could honestly only see that getting just about that ridiculous. I mean, I know everything's kind of reliant on the RNG, but it just, oh, to an extent such as that. I was actually even getting some decent guns. That wasn't entirely the RNG's fault. Like, you know, I'm, I'm just trying to give the RNG props where it deserves it, because if you make, if you call the RNG out for something that was not its fault, it will wreck you. It does it to me every time you do not disrespect the god that is RNG. Uh, yeah, okay, thrown butt. Dude, I've been practicing with Rebel as always. She's still my main. She's still my fave. I feel bad for chicken. I, I, the other day, I, I, I did a run, I was trying to do, god dang, I was trying to do a, a rebel run, and I accidentally clicked chicken, and we just sat there, and it was like passing an X on the street, and then we played, and the run went okay, I'm sorry, rebel! It meant nothing! Dun, 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 dun. I really need to use my babies! Cause for, I got thrown butt, that's all I have right now. Come on! Yeah. Litter him. That's the only word I, I can think to describe that action. The amount of bullets that was properly. You must litter him. Wreck his central park with bullets. Right? Makes a little, a little sense, I guess. I think it makes a little sense. Oh, you know what's going to help us a lot right now? Well, I guess in the short term, at least, you know, second stomach. But I mean, come on. Second stomach. Play the rebel. Oh, God. Is rebel not supposed to be a hard hitting, you know, like a hard character? I don't know, like, uh, people are like, no, Melting's a hard character on purpose, Rebel's not. And I'm kind of curious as to where they got that idea. I mean, it, there are a lot of things that the Vlam guys say on stream that I haven't watched, and they're like, well, here's the link. Then I stick a stream foot in my mouth and, you know. I don't know, I, I like it. I keep, I keep, I keep saying I like her. Because she's like, she's a gambly type character, less so now than before. I don't know. Uh, it, it, it's some time has passed. What do you guys think? What do you guys think about the new rebel? Have you gotten some time to play with her? Have you gotten some time to give her? Have you have you uh, dedicated, you know, some some valid time with her? Did you try it? <laughs> anyway, I don't know why I'm being so confrontational about that. For once, last wish seems kind of appealing, but this is also kind of how Rebel is. I really wish I could get a hold of stress. I'm getting a really bad lineup of mutations this run. This is very unfair, game. I don't like it. I mean, I, I don't even I don't even know what to take. I mean, I, I usually end up with a bolt weapon by the end of my run, so I, okay, fine. You know, bolt marrow, whatever. Don't light me on fire yet. <laughs> I really should not have come out here. This is a bad. I this is a very bad idea. <laughs> you look like a gift wrap burrito. Sharp teeth. Sharp teeth is a masterpiece for Rebel. I take the damage and they feel it. Very few things to say that are bad a bit about that. Man, I got some some laser brain. I'm wrecking. Laser brain. I don't know. I, whoa, buddy. Bullet and energy, I think, got the best mutations. I mean, come on. Straight up damage output. And just having more ammo, which again results in damage output. I don't know. I I, I got bolt marrow in between this episode and the last one. I was playing with it, and it was you know, it it I I, I from what I've figured out or from, from what I see anyway, it seems like it works if you're already pretty close. Like you can't just fire and it homes in on him. Like I I get that. Dang it! I took stupid damage. Stupid damage. Hmm. 
<laughs> Impact wrist. I don't know, second stomach just seems really not cool to take, unless you've already got second stomach on you. Uh, cause then stuff doesn't come out. What? Who even called you? Oh my god, they said they're gonna fix it to where only your hits can call the IDPD. And I really am looking forward to that! Cause I'm sick and tired of the police calling and convicting me for crimes I didn't do! Okay, okay, got a bazooka, got some decent mutations. I keep forgetting- OH no! Oh god, yes, I got a B song. I'm suddenly getting those a lot more. What is that all about? I got like three on the last stream I did of Nuclear Throne. And now I take a coin. I got liquid on. <laughs> ah, coffee. Once it gets below scalding, you can just chug it. Oh my- <laughs> Okay, game. If this is what I gotta do, if I gotta just pop myself out here, yeah, see? The reason I die a lot, though, it's not just, it's not, it's not the game's fault. I mean, obviously it's my own fault, but I mean, come on. I keep going out, what? Three, okay, it's just, yeah, that, was that three shielders? The game really doesn't like me today. I'm kind of bummed out about this. <sighs> keep your bottlenecks. That's, I'm, I'm eventually going to use all of my, put all my failures together and use this wisdom to share unto you a tips and tricks video. Mainly the scrapyard. Keep your bottlenecks. Be another B song? What? Game. Is this my death song? I feel like the game's just feel it just feels bad for me. It's like here. Have <laughs> some music you normally don't hear. Maybe this makes it even. It doesn't, but you know, I don't want to crown Not right now. Nuh uh, come out kids! This could be death at any second now anyway! Mm. <laughs> Everyone, thanks for watching. <laughs> oh, I'm elite MLG pro. Like, I'm sure if you had a good time, it rolls me out. What are you looking at, chicken? God, I know! Your mom was right! Speak softly into my ear again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, with but a whisper!